Hi guys, hey y'all. Okay, so today I'm back with a video. I know it's been a while since I last made a video. It's because I have been very busy. I have been having a whole lot to do guys. Okay, so I'm back today and hopefully I can stay consistent. Alright, so this is my hair two ponytails and these are my earrings I just love and I'm going to get some more and I hope I had I hope I can find every color I think when I was younger I had every single color okay but the weather is what is the weather the weather is cold and it's about 40 in the late 40s or 50s degrees and can you believe guys earlier this week it was in the 80s like one day was even like 84 or 86 almost 90 in February okay so you know I do not like that all right so um what else think that's it. oh and hopefully you guys are doing good doing great and everything is going your way you are being positive believing in yourself taking care of yourself and just loving yourself and if you aren't here's some positive vibes sent your way to love yourself believe in yourself and all that good positive stuff okay so um we're going to be talking today we're going to be talking about being judgmental okay and judgmental people now of course we know that everybody in the world i mean well yeah everybody in the world goes around judging everybody and they don't even know them sometimes and they judge them and think crazy things about them and all that crazy stuff now not that you should be worrying about it because you shouldn't care what other people think about you especially if they want to think something really bad about you and you know it's not true you shouldn't be worrying about it but just to say it's still in the world you know that people judge you and just read some people judge you so bad that they even react on it okay like for example I know you know some people that will judge you and they have not a clue who you are like you could be the best person in the world which is why you shouldn't judge but you could be the best person in the world or close to the best person in the world or one of the best people in the world you know and you have so much to offer and so much just so much inside to offer you know and being in the wrong place i guess will probably put you in situations where people would judge you or you could be in the right place and people judge you maybe there's a lesson for you to learn you know we all have lessons in life that we have to learn in order to grow some you may not know that you're going through lessons you know but spiritually and as I always say, I believe in God. Don't know who you believe in. Don't care. You know, that's not what this is about. So if you believe in God, then you can relate. If you don't, just sit back and probably, you probably might learn something. And if you don't, then I'm not judging, you know, as the video says. Don't judge. But that's just who I believe in, you know. And I always have to say that because people always seem to get really tensed up and you know sometimes when you talk about what you believe in okay not everybody believes in the same thing and that's understandable over here okay i can understand you don't believe if you don't believe in god you believe in a statue or you know some other thing that's your problem you know but for me i believe in god okay so with my beliefs of god i believe spiritually because i'm a spiritual person i believe when you go through certain things yes you are you are being taken on a journey 
of learning okay so like God is trying to teach you what you are not good at such as if something that people does you know if something that people do if it bothers you like a whole lot and you just cannot get over it you know but you shouldn't be thinking about it and you should not be worrying about it but if it bothers you a whole lot like that to the point where you get very upset sometimes and feel like you just you know have to do something or you just have to say something or whatever you know um instead of learning how to ignore crazy people from their judgmental ways and their reactions because of their judgmental ways you're being taken on a lesson you you're being guided to learn how to be more stronger in that area um, and I know because I do go through that a lot and in the end I actually do learn you know and it does actually make me become a much stronger person in certain areas um, so I, I can basically always tell when I am being like when God is leading me to be on a journey of being more stronger because during that time people test my patience very bad and during that time I'm getting triggered very very bad and it's like hard sometimes for me to not explode basically on someone and just tell them exactly how I'm feeling and that you would never want to do because you know once people find out things like that about you it's gonna keep happening it's gonna always happen you know so the best thing to do is just not worry about that for the most part let's say like you shouldn't worry about it if a person is around you or if a person well basically if the people person whatever is around you that triggers you you have no other choice but for them to be around you okay um and you just and they do things you know like they do unnecessary things maybe for attention maybe for just i don't know maybe because you don't talk to them maybe because you're not their friend you don't catch on to signs and signals that they actually want to be your friend or maybe they're jealous you know that could be well that's not always you don't always have to be jealous to be judgmental but you know there's different type of people in the world so you could be jealous they could want to be you they could you know it's just so many reasons because judging people and then reacting okay because I don't think I explained that but when you judge people well people and stuff okay people that judge people they are rebelling is what I'm trying to say so let's just say like for example if they judge you they let's say they think that you're a bad person but you're really not let's say you're the sweetest person in the world okay but when you come in contact with different people they don't know you so they go off base probably their i their ideas of how you are probably because of what someone else told you or what things may look like you know because you can look like a bad person sometimes depends on what you do and that's what I learned if you stay off to yourself a lot a lot of people will think that you know you're a bad person you're plotting something you have something planned like you want to steal something you want to take something so you're being off to yourself so people don't notice you or something I don't know you know I never understood why people think that but there are actually some people in the world that just don't want to intervene with everyone and it's probably because maybe the people you know just don't mix with you maybe they watch the people and the people don't mix well with you so you just try to stay away because maybe you don't want drama maybe you don't want to cause any problems and you see that the person is a problematic person okay um, but yeah so people judge you oftentimes I used to think that if you were 
like just all out all the time, just really loud and doing all kind of things and, you know, getting to all kind of stuff, then you would get judged, you know, because as like being like, oh, you know, that person's going to do something to me. I better do this. I better watch out and stuff like that, you know, although you're supposed to be watching out for everybody, no matter if you are sweetheart or whatever else, because you never know people and people click quick sometimes okay so but you know after some time if nothing is really happening and you know you're not doing anything you know and the person like people are trying to do things just like to trigger you okay because you're not doing anything um you know I guess you should just not worry about that but you know because they're gonna judge you people are gonna judge you anyway and sometimes their judging is like really terrible things I mean they could be heartbreaking things when you hear them they could make you mad make you sad make you even cry or whatever you know you might even wonder why but after some time you know don't drive yourself crazy thinking about why they think this about you why they're judging you and don't even know you didn't even have too much time to even get to know you so you don't even know where their judgmental ways are coming from thoughts are coming from and most of the time it's always someone behind the judging 